one thing that I want to bring into everything, which, um, you know, we do do upgrades. So we do remodel. So if someone's buying a house that say <clears throat> they love this house, but they want to tear it down or <clears throat> they want to add a second story. So, you know, that's something that I'm seeing a lot more of is either people <clears throat> that are just looking, they see a vision with a house. It's, it's a little bit older. They want to redo the kitchen and add a second story. And, so we do remodel loans too. It's it's similar. It's a construction loan, but we just call it a remodel. So in a lot of those cases, you're seeing that as well, where there's a you know someone living in a house already or something along those lines. So, but yeah, there there are options for remodels, or if you're looking to buy a house and you're just like, hey, this house would be perfect, but I need a little bit bigger size. Well, we can come in. You buy the house, get your plans and permits, and we can give you that second story on that ranch house or whatever have you. And how would that work? Because like, let's say that they do buy that house, but that house, they have a first loan on it already. Essentially, you guys would be offering like a renovate, a construction or renovation loan, but essentially right. take the place of the first loan. So it would have to have enough uh, uh, equity after the cons or the finished product would have to be worth more to be able to make it worth it. Am I kind of understanding? Sort of. Sort of. So let's just use another example of now that you have a turnkey house that's a little bit beat up let's say and let's say they go to you and they buy for a million but for a million dollars okay and then they take six months plus to go ahead and um you, they want to build a second story to that right so all of a sudden that house you're you're keeping the structure of the house right you're just adding another Maybe you're just redoing the kitchen and adding a second story. Uh -huh. Well, we'll go. We'll use whatever the the anticipated new value would be on that new house, right? With the second story, you probably add in. Let's use a million seven or a million eight, right? At that point, so then we'll give you seventy to eighty percent of that new value of a million seven, million eight. So there's enough equity there to give you your construction loan and still pay off her previous loan that Laura gave to you.